I love writing in calligraphy. I use it all the time, in my diary, for greeting cards, for shopping lists, if I'm feeling fancy. A lot of books and calligraphy tutorials out there teach you how to imitate and memorize an existing font, and that's great, I've done that. I've memorized fonts that I use sometimes, but my go-to calligraphy font that I use the most is one that I made myself based on my own handwriting, and it wasn't that difficult. So if you've always wanted to try calligraphy or you've always wanted to make your own font, then this video is for you. Supplies. I like these parallel pens. They come in different sizes. The smaller ones are easier to use. The ink is refillable and they look really beautiful. I also use these calligraphy markers. I use these a bit more often because they're a little less intimidating. But you could also use anything with a straight tip, like a highlighter. Step 1. Hold your pen at a 45 degree angle. Now, write out the alphabet as you would in your own handwriting. Step 2. Make it curvy. This is the fun part. Add little swooshes at the beginning and at the end of your letters. Turn all the straight lines into pretty curved lines, or just do your own thing. Make it as ornate or simple as you like. And that's it! Now you got your own calligraphy font! I'm going to write out a few quotes just to show you what you can create with your own brand new font. 50 points if you can guess who said this quote. Let me know in the comments if you like calligraphy or if you made your own font. What would you call it? What should I call my font? Hmm. Special thanks to my brand new patrons. Bye! When I was in grade 2, my grandmother bought me a book of fonts, kind of like this one, and I loved it. I would just copy out the fonts over and over again. Yeah, I was a weird kid.